Hi, I'm Matt Hilton with the Ledbetter Academy, and I'm here at PGA National Resort and Spa at the Ledbetter Academy Short Game Facility. I've got a little shot simulated here from right next to the green that sometimes I feel like a lot of students misplan early on in the round. And the shot here, if I'm looking at a short pin up over a bunker, kind of requires a lot of loft to land nice and soft and get me a kind of controlled, accurate shot next to the hole. But the real thing that I feel students mess up is early on in the game is not the time to add extra risk into your game. It's kind of convenient the NFL playoffs are going on right now. I almost want you to feel like, picture what your NFL team, your average NFL team does early on in a game. Basically, they take a fourth of their downs. When they ever, every time they reach fourth down, they give the ball to the other team. Why? Because it's too risky to go for it, make sure that we kind of get every yard we can. So early on, I want you to be a little less risky and almost think, well, I can actually take a lot of this risk out of play, take maybe a nine iron, don't go over that bunker, hit a shot maybe somewhere over to the left side of the green, just get me on the putting surface so maybe I've got a 20 footer for my next shot rather than leaving it in the bunker. Then think about it, look, it's the end of the game that you're gonna start seeing that NFL team go, look, it's do or die time, our back's against the wall, simulated maybe, you know, you're getting to the 17th hole, you're one down to your buddy and you're kind of, you got to get this shot up and down. Hey, there's a lot less pressure on this shot to try to go over the bunker and hit it high and soft next to the hole, knowing that if I fail, oh well, I was already behind, okay? So give it a shot. If you can make sure that you kind of plan a little more conservative early on in your round and make a little more aggressive decision later on if you need to.